Hello everybody, this is um, Ian here again with another tutorial, and I just, in the last uh, recording, I just talked to my own self basically because the mic was muted. So six minutes of talking to my own self, pretty awkward. <laughs> so if you haven't seen my other tutorials, go ahead and check them out on YouTube, it's very um, easy and probably hard. And hold on, I'm going to pause for a minute. Okay, now I'm back. Um, Here it is, the third tutorial, okay. Since my family just came in, that's amazing. All right. So in the last tutorial, we'll just go ahead and um, we'll open this up right here. And I already did it. My own, I did it to. Uh, uh -huh. Never mind. Hold on. All right. Just go ahead and delete that. All right. Today, what we're gonna be looking at is um, the set command and the set slash a is off. Okay. This is that's what we're gonna be learning today. And here we go. Percentage and on percentage um at sign echo off to start it all off. Title title tutorial and that's the main Oh you know. well, we're gonna, in between these two we're gonna do the set command. The set command is like a variable, say for example, and I'll tell you what the variable is. So let's go ahead and say you want your HP up to a hundred. Alright. So a variable is meaning that if you put any word or letter and equal it a number or anything else. And yeah, that was the doorbell. Okay, that's what I was doing. Well we do the uh set command, you know. <laughs> okay. Never mind about that. Because for some reasons the doorbell just caught me off guard. Okay. So what we're technically what we're doing is we're doing the HP, making it equal to 100. So now this word right here equals to 100. But what if we want that word to be on there anyways? Well, batch people made a um, made um made a thought probably and said, you know what, we're just gonna put two percentages and put HP right there, so we can say that this variable that we're using right here, whatever they typed in, will equal the amount that they put in. So that's genius of them. So let's go ahead and pause that, and I'll tell you everything about it. So you open it, and it'll say it equals to 100, or it'll just say 100 on the screen. So what it basically just did was we uh, we set this word equal to 100, and so what we did we had these um, percentages around it though, so we indicate that this is a variable, and we're putting the the, the name or letter or whatever you put in into this and it'll equal the amount as you say. Say like say for example seventy five, open it and it'll say seventy five on the screen, like right there. So I hope you guys get what I mean. Alright. So let's go ahead and put that back to hundred. And let's say we want to change that. That's when we do the set slash a command, which means to change or addition to or subtract or multiply any variable that you want to. So let's go ahead and say, well, we got to put our HP um, variable right there so we know that we're changing it. Percentage, HP percentage, because that's where we're focusing on that variable to see what we're going to do to it. So let's say we could do add, or well, we could do subtract, <laughs> add, uh, let's see, what is it? multiply, divide, anything else. But what we're going to do is we're going to maybe subtract it by 10. Alright, so if we want to see it, we can just go echo that HP, that, and, and wait, wait, we got the pause. So, we open it, and it will say 90, and that was retarded of me because for some reason I did not put pause right there also. Oh, and total, f okay, so we just save that, and then we do this, and then now it's 100, now it's 90. So all we did is we subtract it by using the set slash a command. So technically it's set slash a and then the HP variable. Sorry for the background noise if you can hear it. And then percentage percentage HP, which is the variable right here. Oh right here. And we're subtracting it by ten. So I hope you guys can get that. That was a short tutorial, but now next time I'm, without the mic I'm gonna do a time lapse of my um game I'm creating called The Worlds of Sambia. It's a, a zombie shooting game and hoping it to be split screen, so if you, it'll be probably done, and you know, maybe, I don't know, whatever. But 
the website will be in the the, the subscription if you want to um, join my batch team whenever um, you're learning all this batch stuff by me or anyone else just go ahead and ask um, from the website and I'll forbid you well so I hope you guys get what this tutorial is this is Ian Animator Pro and see you later